I'm on the Rams here, uh, Ed. I referenced last week when they went into Arizona that that was kind of a right-the-ship game where they needed to work on a few things, get their pieces all straightened out, and they did exactly that. I thought it was a nice fine-tuning type of an effort and that they will repeat what they did in that game. Jared Goff throwing for over 400 yards. Look, he hasn't been that great this year. I think he's back on track. And when the Rams get good, in other words, when they blow teams out, when they have won by 14 points or more, they have been 4-0 against the spread in their next start. So I see them putting two games back-to-back flawless type of performances, and that spells bad news for the Seattle Seahawks, who have found a way to win a lot of games this year. I don't think they do it coming down to L.A. I hate to be a bit of a buzzkill here sort of in general when previewing a game like this, but I think this is nothing more than a game filled with volatility. You look at the first matchup between the Seahawks and the Rams, and it really could have broken either way. You had a missed field goal at the end. You had random plays bouncing in various ways. And granted, Russell Wilson ranks third in scrambles, averages nearly eight yards when he takes off. He gets split second most frequently, and he's still playing at a very high level, an MVP level almost. Then Seattle comes in with the fourth worst uh, defense uh, in terms of generating quarterback pressures, which is good news for Jared Goff because with a clean pocket, he can be a very good football player. When he's pressured, though, he has some trouble. And so you look at all four phases, and it really does even out. It's just that Seattle's had a lot more breaks, and Russell Wilson is playing uh, far better when pressured, when outside of the pocket. And so I throw all of this in there, and this game really could go either way. And I think because it went Seattle's way in the first meeting, I think we'll go in LA's way, uh, LA's direction second. It's a coin flip situation for you. Exactly. I'm going to go with the I'm going to go with the Rams. Yeah, I, I think they they need to get hot here at the end of the season, and I think they will. I think they get this win. Slight favorite here at minus one.